Bryce out of eBay. eBay. <laughs> Here. Here. So Sorry. just wanted to give you an update on some of our items. Um, we had a video about the green singer sewing machine. Yep. Um, that ended up selling. So I shipped that off last night. Yeah. Um, so we did a little clip, clip. of that. So and then here's the singer. And then you Hi guys, guys. Uh, the bright side of eBay. eBay. And um, today we're gonna be doing kind of a short clip because we have an item that the sewing machine. Mm -hmm. It's so heavy. heavy. Yeah. So um, it's sold. Gonna, yeah, it's, it's sold. sold. So we're doing this clip because we have to pack it out tonight. Yes. And, and uh, last last time that we had it, we. You know, we said we were charging $56 for the shipping because it was really, really heavy. Super heavy. So, now we're going to weigh it. Um, the shipping probably isn't going to cost that much, but, you know, I, it's going to take me some time to get it packed up and shipping and handling. Um, but we're curious to see how much it weighs that, because we haven't quite narrowed it down. Uh, and so... You said it's about 30 pounds? Yeah, we're saying we're going to guesstimate 30 pounds. So we're gonna. I'm gonna film Zeke weighing himself, and then he's gonna weigh himself with the sewing machine, the Singer sewing machine. See how much it's added, yes. and we'll be right back. Guys, uh, so right now we're gonna weigh me. Then we're gonna put this on it, and we're gonna see how much it weighs in comparison to me. <laughs> I don't know how much. Okay, so, so let's how see. much do you weigh? I weigh. 83 pounds. pounds around that. Okay, so 83 pounds. And um, the wait, 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 wait. and the sewing machine. We have we don't know. Going, going, going. Final 35. 35 pounds, pounds in six point six. Six grams or something. I can't Let's remember see. how it is. Thirty-five pounds. So, pretty heavy. In comparison to me, it's I think it's uh, fifty-three less pounds, basically. Yeah. So pretty heavy. So I'll ship that off tonight. So have to wait. That will go off and. That's it. That's our singer sewing machine. Bye. See you in the full video. Okay. So guys, uh, that, that was, was the it. clip of our singer machine. So as yeah, you can see, so it was it super was, heavy. Yeah, compared 30. to me, it was like thirty three. No, it was thirty five pounds. Thirty five pounds. And you weigh like eighty something. Eighty three. Yeah. yeah, it was a so lot. I was fifty. Yeah, it just <laughs> almost I don't fifty. Know. But it was um, heavy. Yes, it was very heavy, and um, so we ended up charging fifty six dollars for the shipping, which I know sounds really high. Um, but overall, but, we ended up lowering the price to eighty nine. So our total ended up being one hundred and forty five, which was lower than the other people. Which who were yeah, it was really it's lower than the other people. Um, we did only buy the singer for forty dollars, and then the shipping ended up only being twenty seven dollars. So, but but I will handling. tell you. Hand, yes, I will Handle. tell you, not an easy it's item not just shipping. to ship. Exactly. What did, what did it say? That's why it always says shipping and handling. Handling, handling mm. was hard. Yeah, it was See, not that's an why. easy we're, item we're, to ship. We're not just greedy people. <laughs> no. I would suggest that, you handling. know, you get, be prepared. If you get an item that's big, you're going to have to take a little time to pack it, and it's got to be packed well. The box... You've got to have a package where nothing is moving. You know, when you shake the box, there's no movement. It's got to be totally the, like immersed suspended in, air. in the middle of the box, so that you have you don't ever want to ship an item and then the customer get it and something's damaged. So. That's only happened to us once. Yes, that did happen to us once. We had these. Actually, in one of our videos, we had these mission a mission lot. And they were all these ceramic mission slots. And no, I thought it was something else. Yeah. No, that one. And, and then it broke it. And one of them got to the guy, right? Yes, one but of them broke. But he didn't care that much, right? 
No, I ended up giving um, a partial refund. So um, another one of our tips was going to be open um, to bleh. open communication. Yeah. Open <laughs> communication. So, like, be honest with your customer. If they have any questions, let them, mm-hmm. like, you know. Know what's going question. on. If you're running late with the like, shipment. Like, don't lie to them. Be like, there's definitely no cracks. And then they get it, and there's, like, a crack. Then you're going to be in bad mm-hmm. trouble, and they're going to leave a bad review, and then you're going to not get as much customers, and then you're not going to make money, and that's not good. And then you're out of business. And then you're out of business. See ya. Hasta la vista, baby. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> but, uh, yes, that item I series did, of events. I did end up breaking one of the missions. Um, I apologized. There was a bunch of missions that I sent. There was, like, six six of them or How seven of them. How many you broke? One. Okay. One. Okay. So I did give him a partial refund or her a partial refund, the customer partial refund. They were really happy, and they actually left me positive feedback. So. Yay. Open communication. See? That's what happened. Worked out. Yeah. Sometimes, you know, stuff happens. Um, but you live and you learn. And I've learned that I package my things very well because I do not want my stuff to be damaged. And you don't want them the to leave a negative feedback. Yeah. Um, so this weekend we went to San Antonio. Yes, visit the family for Easter. Mm-hmm. Happy Easter. Happy Easter. So here's a clip of us in San Antonio. I went to an estate sale on a Saturday, and it was 50% off. Didn't find that much, but I wanted to show you guys a little outing of the estate sale. And then after I got back from the estate sale, uh, I took pictures of one of the items and showed you the process. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. here you go. Hi guys, it's the bright side of eBay. Um, Zeke's not feeling too well, but it's Saturday morning. I'm actually in San Antonio visiting um, my parents, and we're here at an estate sale. It's 50% off, so let's see what we can find, and I'll get back to you once we leave the estate sale. Thanks. Um, just left the estate sale, so there wasn't that much, because usually when it's 50% off, there's not gonna be a ton of stuff, but we did, uh, were able to find some. So I got this Luma Pro weatherproof incandescent wall fixture. So this right now is going on eBay for like $35, $40, and it was $5 initially. Got it for 50% off, so it was $2.50. So I got that. I got this really cool cookie jar. Um, it's a stove and got that for $8 and it's also selling on eBay right now for $35 to $40. And last item, Dallas Cowboys, little chair. And uh, we'll have to look that up to see how much that's selling for, um, but it's from 1996 and got that for $5. That's it. It's Bright of eBay here and um, today we're just going to be showing you the process of taking pictures of items and stuff just like that. Here hanging out at the grandparents' house. Yep. Easter weekend. Happy Easter. Um, so first you obviously need to take just a front picture. Then you just shift it. Make it a side picture. Go to the other side. And eBay lets you do 12 pictures, so we do usually try to do as about many yeah as many pictures as possible because everybody wants to see all and angles. Then. Yep. And then the lid. And then once we're done, we'll go ahead and post it. Um, this one, we're going to go ahead and post for $35. And a little in. You can get a little closer. Oh, the inside of that. Yeah. So that's a little nice, cute little piece. Vintage. 
cookie jar for your kitchen. So, that's it. So yeah, it's just a small cookie jar. And uh, yeah, that's how you take your pictures and stuff. Like that. See you later. See ya. So, so that, that was is, uh, the picture process, and uh -huh. yeah, Our I did a great job, job, obviously. <laughs> and actually, the first one we did, <laughs> the sound corrupted. Because we, we shot it on... Um, An older uh, phone. Yes, on, on my mom's. On my mom's phone. <laughs> and then the sound was corrupted, and we couldn't use it. <laughs> so we had to reshoot. Yeah. So, but, um... That's why I was using that phone. That and yeah, an old too. phone. But anyway, yeah. we got the pictures taken. We got those uploaded. Um, so we've got that, um, the cookie jar. Yeah. The oven, old school vintage. That's posted right now for 35 Yep. So we'll give you an update, let you know how that goes. Mm -hmm. Um, and then another little story about one of our items recently. Um, and another, uh, video we had our Pioneer radio. Yes. It was a three, four piece, sorry, four piece, four piece, four piece stereo. Uh, amplifier cassette deck and the customer so he sent me a best offer and I actually countered I know I've said before don't counter but, but I just I was like I don't know I just felt like I got a counter I got yeah counter. I was there I said he said like 150 he said 150 and, and I, I said, said one well you I, said I told her to say 175 mm-hmm and what did you say? I was like, no, I'm going to do 190. And then he was like, no, no, no. And he was like, what did it say? 175. So what What should have she done just the first time? Just said 175. <laughs> just. But the interesting thing is my listing was for four units, Pioneer units. And he only wanted three. three. So she can just sell another part, and then she even so, gets more money. Yeah. So, so I she wasn't that. really losing money, right? Yes. And so she I packed that up last night, which again, a process. But I got it for thirty-five dollars. Sold it for one hundred and seventy-five dollars, so, and I still have one more piece. So I can sell this piece. I mean, at least thirty, forty dollars. I can sell this piece for. Yeah. Um. Interesting thing. The cassette deck does not work. What? Mm -hmm. That always happens with these things. Mm -hmm. the like belts I go out, yeah. stuff but happens. Did we show them the other there. one? We did show them the other one, right? Yeah. Yeah, a lot of yeah. our cassette decks All, are broken. Yeah, whenever we always get them, we're always like, oh yeah, if the cassette player um, works, it'll be worth even more money. Mm -hmm. Then we try it, and it's broken. Yes. I mean, it makes sense. But they're vintage, you know, stuff like that happens. But people fix them. People still, yeah, people know how to, I don't know how to repair them, but other we people should, out there. We should, but. Maybe we should invest, take a class. Maybe. Learn how to I fix don't know. belts. <laughs> fix oh, belts. I don't know. I don't know if I have time for that. But <laughs> be honest with your customers. Make sure you put that in the listings. You can put yeah, it don't right in the title. Them. Or else they'll you find can, out. One well, way of course, they'll find out. So, but people will still want those vintage items, and um, so those will still sell. So I'll go ahead and repost the cassette deck as mm -hmm. for parts or repairs, or you know, used, partially working, something like that, and get probably another thirty, thirty or forty dollars for that. Mm -hmm. And that's it for me. What you got? Um. Oh, our <laughs> shout out. Today goes to Crazy, if you can see that, Crazy NY Driver or Crazy New York Driver. Um, they were our 99th subscriber, so yes. Yeah. And he has his own channel as well. Has and great he has, eBay tips. I think. Awesome eBay tips, so I highly suggest. Yeah, uh, he has 11,568 subscribers. So yes, and, and very good content. Cool. Very good content. So we appreciate you subscribing and um, just hope that these videos kind of help people who are beginners want to know maybe what yeah. to sell and just little ins and out of And eBay. also entertaining. <laughs> yes. Because it's kind of boring. 
whenever they're just talking like like this they're like yeah if you should if you get this for four dollars <laughs> uh, so yes entertainment yeah that yeah entertainment funny <laughs> entertainment okay well that's making all it we more got. interesting so subscribe, Have fun, sell. like, and sell. Oh, and, and check com- our eBay. Comment thing. on. Oh yeah, we're gonna put our. our we've been putting our store on there, so yeah. if you're interested in getting any stuff, and, and then comment if you want to get a shout out. Yeah, from us. you have to say you subscribe. Yeah. So, so we'll see you next time. See you next time. Bye. Bye.